All right, hello, hello, everybody. Um, I'm doing a re-recording of the final exam for Canard because my um, system went down. So these are my exam questions. Um, there's been some several other questions that were not on mine. So as you go through these um, and you still have further questions, please contact me um, at 702-232-5499. And I have them all written down here um, to make sure you guys pass, okay? So what will guests receive if they reserve their next cruise on board? It all depends on the voyage, okay? It's 3% fair discount, okay? So that is that answer to that question. Which of the following Royal Knight theme balls are on canard liners? It is all of them except the Cinderella ball and bowling ball, okay? So it's the masquerade, ascot, and captain's black and white ball. Pillow options for the pillow concierge. For the grills guests, they get nine options for pillows, guys. Nine. How long was the first canard crossing from Liverpool to Boston? It was actually 14 days. And if you guys are taking this test, so you know, um, this question could be your 40th question, okay? So again, um, the questions are out of order, so don't, don't get confused on that. Just remember or take a screenshot or whatever, and then um, when you get to your question, you can always go back or forward, etc. All right, next question. What documentation is required for guests upon boarding? It's a passport and they also may need a visa and medical requirements, okay? So you need to make sure all three of those. Um, they will not be able to board if these are required, okay? So it's the passport, visa, and medical. The name of the alternative fine dining restaurant aboard all canard ships is the veranda, okay? Alternative fine dining, veranda. At which level of accommodations can guests order any dish assigned from their assigned restaurant to be served in their suite? That is both the princess and the queen's grill. So that's how they, you know, they get the upgrades, okay? So remember that. They can order um, in-room service from the re fine dining restaurant, okay? What is the maximum number of bookings at which your group might qualify for the tour conductor credits? It is 16 births on all voyages. So remember that 16 births, okay? Which canard liner features the first planetarium at sea? That is the Queen Mary II, first planetarium. Common myths about canard. It's expensive, class system on board, too formal, stuffy, boring, old fashioned, and it's for old people. So these are all myths, okay? Click them all, check all that apply, it is all of them. The deposit, <laughs> excuse me, required when guests reserve their next non-world voyage on board. Non-world voyage, it is a $300 USD or $300 CAD per guest, okay? Which of the following amenities are, are available to all the guests in the grills, okay? It's not specific to the Queen's Grill or the Princess Grill, it's all grills. So they each get pillow concierge and they get turned down service. Okay. All right. What, which of the following are styles that are part of evening dress code? Evening dress code, it's gala evenings and smart attire. Okay.
In which location is the afternoon tea not served? It is not served in the steakhouse at the veranda. All right. So again, make sure you pay attention. Where is it not served? And hopefully it's not going to go off on me again. My internet's been going in and out and it's really been frustrating. So I apologize. All right. As you guys know, Canard has been very, very tough. Um, you know, with with the system. And again, if you pass the test, now look, hopefully it'll let me review it. If not, I'll have to retake it again. Hey, kitty cat. Yeah, see, it didn't take it for me. So now I get to do it again. This is so frustrating, guys. Luckily, I took a picture. Hey, kitty cat. All right, so here we go, guys. So I'll probably get different questions this time. We already went through all this on the prior recording. All right, which of the following are special transfers? So it's motor coach, private limousine, and private sedan. Common miss. Remember that was all of them? Drink packages. There's four of them, okay? Um, soft drinks, beer and wine, premium drinks, and I think it's the wine collection. Hold on. Um, specialty hot drinks. Um, beer, wines, and spirits. I think it was these four. Incorrect. Okay. Um, so it's probably the wine collection also. So I missed that one. So add the wine collection to that one. How often is ballroom dancing on the canard? It is every night. In addition, their own exclusive diamond club members receive the same as gold. So as they go up, guys, they still get the same. So silver will get the gold or gold will get the silver and platinum, you know, so on. So that is true. They get their own benefit plus the prior's benefits. Dining options in addition to the grills. I think they said this was all of them. Um, let me see. Dining options. I think it's all of them. Correct. Voyage preparation is at time of booking. What is not a special event voyage? That was the Australia gardening journey. Which of the following may be offered to full world voyage guests? <laughs> um, 
We just had this, I think it's, is it artifacts on here? Which of the following may be offered a full world voyage guess? Revisit, gala. I'm thinking it's this one. Again, guys, sorry, some of these we uh, miss. Um, what? I'm doing my training, what? All right, I'm thinking it's this. I'm going to just try it. Nope, that's incorrect. Highest level of accommodations. That's the Queen's Grill. What is prospecting in terms of marketing? All available resources. First scheduled transatlantic service began on which ship? Oh, I don't think we've got that one. I'm going to go ahead and say the Queen Mary. Incorrect. Sorry, guys. What's up? You like the coffee. No, I just haven't had it yet. Oh. Uh, what will guests receive if they serve their next cruise on board? Uh, that's where they get the 3%. Family reunion group is called the Affinity. Polar Online is simple web version of the same system reservationists use. That is correct. Which of the following describes true ocean liners, purpose-built ships for comfort on long voyages? What is the name of the Queen Mary II exhibit that features 10 historical pathways throughout the liner? <laughs> Illuminations, I think it is. Nope. Ah. Sorry, guys. I don't know what that one is. How many age groups are there for the children's program? There's three. Which canard liner features the first planetarium? That is uh, Queen Mary II. I think that's right. Correct. What is the highest loyalty level? Ooh, forgot the platinum level above loyalty level. Sorry, I just looked that up. Google's your best friend, right? What is the loyalty level for Canards World Club? Silver, gold, platinum, and diamond. So diamond is it. Which of the following are Canard World Platinum benefits? So platinum benefits. Let's see what platinum benefits include. Sorry, guys. Again, um, some of these come up. So platinum, internet package, four hours. So it's it's um, complimentary wine tasting, internet package, senior officer dinner. Hold on. Okay, platinum. Internet, cleaning, embarkation. We get the discount on White Star. Sorry, guys, I probably got this one wrong. Invitation, wine tasting, disembarkation, cleaning service. I'm just going to say all correct. It's all of them. 
What is the maximum number of bookings to qualify? That's a 16 verse. Guests that sail with Canard are international mix. The age group for the children's club is one through 17. The Royal Court, that's the pillars, private boxes and 830 seats. How long was the first crossing from Liverpool to Boston? That was 14 days. Canard, Canardia features what kind of items? This is the one, artifacts, this one. Canardia, okay? Canard, Canard memorabilia and artifacts. The Grills Lounge on each ship is exclusive for Queen's Grill guests. That's false, it's also for Princess Grill. The Grills Lounge is for both Princess and Queen's Grill. How many years has Canard been sailing? I don't have that one either. I'm thinking it's over 180, but let's look and see. How long has Cunard Cruise Line been sailing? Um, launched in 1938, in the 1940s, correct, which the following are among the first at sea. So that's everything but the skating rink. Which sailings on Canard features guest lectures? All sailings, okay? They have the guest lectures on all sailings. What's the deposit when guests reserve for their next non-voyage? That was 300. Canard voyages sailed during which months? That was January through May. How many guests does a Queen Victoria accommodate? Okay, I think that's this one, Queen Victoria. Correct, 20, 2061. How many books are in the largest library at sea? It's over 8,000. What is the name of the buffet dining area that highlights different cuisines throughout the day on the Queen Mary II? I think that was the King's Court. Correct. How long is one lap around the Queen Mary? That is one third of a mile. How many guests does the Queen Mary II accommodate? That was 2691. Canard Complete Air has many beneficial features, including all of the above. Which ship has alfresco dining in the courtyard? That is Elizabeth and Victoria, alfresco dining. Oops, hold on. I just need to make sure I'm recording over here, otherwise I'm gonna be, yes. Canard carried more immigrants from Europe to America in the 19th century than any other single company. I don't know, but I think it's true. That's correct. How many guests does Queen Elizabeth accommodate? Wow, they're hitting them all, right? 2,081. If guests are undecided about where they want to go and cruise again, what can they purchase? That is the future cruise deposit, okay? And according to Canard, luxury today is all the above except for ostentatious. Canard Care covers medical emergencies in the following destinations. Anywhere in the world. Which of the following amenities are available to all guests in the grills on all liners? Hello. Turn down. I, I got this wrong. 
I'm going to say those three. Correct. Shoe shine, turn down, and pillows. Okay. Canard distinctive emotional appeal can be summarized by the which themes? Entertainment, affluence, service, legacy, grandeur, inspiration. I'll probably say that one. Correct. A guest is making a reservation for a voyage 30 nights or less from today. Deposit of what amount is required? Deposit of 25% within three days. I think that was one I didn't have before. Yep, 25 and three days. Correct. Where was Samuel Kennard, the founder, born? Halifax, Nova Scotia. <sighs> Almost done. Okay, what falls masquerade ascot captains black and white? Correct. Come on, guys. Let's do this. Yes. 92%. All right, guys. So again, congratulations. Um, this was a tough one. So, you know, if you were with us as a, we've been on for three hours doing this, um, but you guys got it easy because I gave you all the answers now. Um, there are some additional questions that were not on the test, um, but maybe on your test. So again, guys, um, if you do get that, let me know um, and I can help you with that. Text me at 702-232-5499. Um, and we'll go ahead and get those answers for you. Couple of them here are um, the no deposit. Um, if they don't pay their deposit, it's 100% cancellation. Uh, we talked about the documents required. Um, what else was there that we had um, that may not be on there? Um, plan your voyage um, at time of booking. Um, the Queen Elizabeth has a games deck, garden lounge, okay? Preparation is 30 days prior. Um, these are just some of the questions that other people had, okay? Um, the china on the ships is wedge wood, okay? Full world voyage, um, reception and dinner, gratuities that one was um, a problem one um air reserve 320 days before that was on there um the cigar place is churchill's uh seven voyages 70 trip is a platinum level uh movies they can watch it in illuminations all right, uh, so I think that's most of it. Um, what was the first in 1996? That was three world voyages in one year. All right, so hopefully you guys got all those. Um, if not, as I said, you can contact me. Um, there's also one more that was a uh, a question. It's super liners of the past. It's like Luciter, Moretta, and Aquaterra, something like that, those three. Okay. All right. So congratulations, everybody. Again, make sure you take a picture because it does not acknowledge it. And that's what this says right here. It will say, take a screenshot uh, to let them know. Okay. So as you see here, I'm going to exit the course now. As you see, I passed. I'm going to exit the course and I'm going to go back. It says that I've done it. Let's see if it updates here and gives me my free cruise. And guess what? Yes, it did. Okay, so I had to do it a second time around. If for any reason it does not, just hit the feedback button and let them know. But now we all got a free cruise. So congratulations, everybody. I'm excited for you. Um, again, we're going to be starting Royal Caribbean, I think, next month. So join us for that. But otherwise, congratulations. And I will be posting this shortly. Thank you. Bye, guys.